Hi everyone, welcome to my kitchen. In this video, I'm going to show you how I cook one of my favorite Nigerian meals, yam porridge, also known as asaro. I'm going to keep the recipe real simple without other complicating things. Please, let's go cook. I'm going to cut, peel and dice half a tuber of yam, give it a good rinse under the tap and set it aside in a bowl of water. I'll leave the yam in water so that it doesn't change colour, that's very important. I'm going to add a quarter cup of palm oil into the pan and let the bleach for a few minutes while I grab my pepper blend. For my pepper blend, I used 400 grams of peeled tomato, one bell pepper, one medium onion, and four scotch bonnet pepper, because you know me, I like my food spicy. I'm, I'm using a non-stick pot, but I still stir the sauce at interval to prevent burning. I'm going to season the sauce with um, a teaspoon of thyme, a teaspoon of salt and a tablespoon of chicken bouillon powder or season to taste, whichever way you like it. If it's too much, re reduce it. If it's not enough, you had a bit more. I'm just going to let that cook for a few more minutes. After about 8 minutes, I'm going to stir in some water, just enough to cook the yam. Um, again, depends on the type of yam you're using. Um, you might need more water. So I'm going to add in my di diced yam and I'm going to let this cook on um, medium heat for about 15 minutes or until it becomes really soft. Don't forget to check at interval to make sure that it's not burning and if you do need to add extra water, please do so. My yam porridge has now been cooking for 15 minutes and I'm going to break up the chunks of yam to thicken up the sauce and create the porridge. I personally like to leave little chunks of yam in there because it's just so nice when you're having it. But if you don't like having chunks of yam, you can break it all up. The yam porridge is now ready. I would reduce the heat and just let it cook for another five minutes on really low heat and then I turn it off. Just look at how beautiful that looks guys and I'm telling you, it tastes so good. Thanks for watching. Bye.